Have you ever paid attention to the type of detergent you're using for your laundry? Have you ever wondered if there could be something better to use than what you see in big box stores? Perhaps a luxury detergent formulated with the finest fragrance. Well, I have just the thing for you. Did you know Lalabo? Yes, Lalabo, one of my favorite candle brands, currently has a detergent collaboration with the Laundress. If you don't know, it's a luxury brand with home cleaning and laundry items. This is considered a luxury channel, so of course I had to tell you about this. Hey, what's up? I'm Rakima. Welcome to Detail Dream, where the primary focus is to expose you to the expansive world of luxury goods for yourself and your home. So we have all of our luxury fragrances scenting our home. We have our favorite luxury candles we burn on a daily, all the way down to luxury fragrances for our cars. But what about the actual clothes we practically wear 99% of the time? How can we add that same luxury experience to our laundry? To be completely honest, it didn't even cross my mind that there could be luxury items, better overall items, that it could be using to make my laundry feel better and smell even better. I got caught up into this normal routine of thinking, oh, I'm out of laundry detergent. I just go get more from Target when I'm out. I got used to the convenience of it being readily available when I'm out running errands. I just haven't been exposed to anything other than those vibrant colors of laundry detergent that takes up an entire aisle of a store. Now, I'm not bashing these items. Clearly, I've been using them up until this point. But it's time to elevate the living experience, elevate the laundry experience to a new level. My friends, Lalabo has come through with laundry detergent. I just couldn't believe what I was seeing. There I was perusing their site when I noticed they had laundry detergent. I was literally in disbelief. Because for one, it's Lalabo, and for two, it's Lalabo. I had my Apple Pay ready until I realized they weren't available for purchase on the site. All hope was not lost because if there was one place that had it, it will most definitely be Nordstrom. And sure enough, there it was. I could have broken my computer screen the way I hit that buy button. All joking aside, I really wanted to experience this detergent. I wanted to see what made it better than what I've been using. Is it really worth the $50 price tag? What made this luxury and is it even considered luxury? This detergent is in collaboration with The Laundress, which is a luxury brand that caters to the cleaning and laundry items for the home. And when I tell you they have it all, they have it all covered. Pretty much anything you can think of from all purpose cleaner and dish soap to many different kinds of laundry detergent for specific uses. Like stain solution, bleach alternative, delicates, whites, cashmere, the list goes on and on. And of course the Lalabo collab detergent, which comes in two different Lalabo scents. Santal 33 and the beautiful Rose 31, which is what I have. Before I dive head first into buying anything else from the laundress, I figured that the Labo detergent would be a great starting point. And I must say, if their other products are anything like this, then I'll start incorporating more of the laundress into my cleaning routine. So what makes this laundry detergent better than what you find in big box stores? What makes it luxury? Let's take a quick look at the back of the bottle because it gives one of the best explanations I've seen. Let me get my ASMR voice on. A nose in your laundry. Why should the finest perfumes always be condemned to a glass spray bottle? Why should even high-end luxury products merely smell fresh and clean? We know you don't know, and neither do we. The Laundress in Lalabo has hence decided to unite and address these incongruities. La Creme de la Creme of detergent formulas formulated with Lalabo's coat range of fragrances. The result? Your favorite sweater or sexy lingerie comes out of the wash clean with the delicate and ultra sensitive smell of Rose 31. The laundries in Lalabo are proud to bring this unique experience to your garment care and expand into this ultimate perfuming gesture. And let me take it a step further with how it's allergen free, biodegradable, and non toxic. This is great for my people who suffer from allergic reactions from using laundry detergent, or you just may want something that's sustainable and effective. The Laundress brand has a focus around creating conscious products, which is a huge plus in my book. Now I'm not going to sit here and act like I know about detergent ingredient formulas because I don't. It's a lot that goes into it. All I know is from the time that I spent washing my clothes with this is that my laundry feels better, softer to the touch, and man, does it smell 10 times better with that amazing Rose 31 scent. I went for the rose because I wanted something that would have that gentle softness of a smell. I love Sand Tower 33, but I think it would have been a little too much for laundry. I could be wrong though, let me know if you tried it and how does it compare. To be completely honest, I'm quite fond of rose when it's done right. This doesn't come off smelling elderly or powdery, or like a chemical for that matter. This smells just how I expected it to smell. It has a beautiful subtle essence of rose absolute blended with that dry warmth of vetiver and rounded off with the softness of cedar. Such an undeniably alluring scent. I really have to pick up the candle after experiencing this detergent. I want to point out, after the drying process, while it doesn't come off smelling artificial, 
The scent isn't necessarily strong either. I actually have one of my t-shirts right here fresh from the dryer. Gotta love that warm, fresh feeling from the dryer. Not that it should be this overpowering scent, it's this nice subtle scent of rose that I'm appreciating. It's a pleasant smell when you go to grab a t-shirt or a towel and you get a nice subtle whiff of something captivating. One thing I dislike about, let's say, Tide or Gain, is that artificial smell they left on my clothes. But after some time of wearing and adding a parfum on top of that, the scent of detergent pretty much fades away. The same goes for the Lalabo detergent as well. I guess it just depends on how much you're using, not that you should be dousing your laundry in detergent. Which brings me to probably my only con with this, if you want to look at it that way. It has to do with the size and pricing. This 16 ounce bottle is $50. And yes, of course, you better believe there is an upcharge just because it's Lalabo. Compared to a regular 33 ounce size detergent from the laundress, that's only $22. But the Lalabo scent is un undeniably good. If you only plan on using this for hand washing laundry like your nice sweaters or delicate fabrics, it would last you 32 washes if you're really conservative with it washing once a week. That's definitely not me, I'll admit that right now. For your normal washing machines, it would last you about 16 washes with the suggested one ounce of detergent per load using the measuring cup the laundress also has. So let's just say, if you're washing one load once a week, it should last you about four months. I might as well scratch that part out because this would be empty way before then. I don't know about you, but I always add in a little residazzle to every load after the suggested amount. I don't put everything into the washing machine, mainly my t-shirts, undergarments, and linens. You know, the basics. My sheets and towels are washed in hot water on a long cycle, and my t-shirts and the like are washed with cold water on a normal cycle. So the scent will vary using different washing modes and how much detergent you use. I take my delicate fabrics to the cleaners, of course, but sometimes the cleaners will get it wrong and mess something up. It happens, so I may test hand washing a sweater to see how it comes out. This detergent performs in a washing machine as I expected it to. I haven't used any enhancements like stain removers or fabric spray, just the detergent alone and it washes as normal. My clothes did come out of the dryer feeling softer than normal with that amazing Lalabo scent, which definitely has improved my overall washing experience. The scent could be stronger, but I'm fine with it because I'm not expecting it to perform like a parfum. I just need my clothes clean with the subtle scent of Rose 31. This is an everyday detergent so it'll work great for the clothing you wash regularly like t-shirts, linen, towels, and undergarments. So who is this detergent for? It's for the person who wants more from the detergent. It's for the person who wants to enhance their laundry experience with the sole purpose of having a Lalabo scent for their laundry and doesn't worry about spending the markup of $50 on a 16 ounce bottle. Here's what I would suggest if you're interested in this to offset some of that cost. I would buy a regular 33 ounce size detergent from the laundress that'll act as my main detergent and on the side I will have the Lalabo detergent that I would just use every once in a while. I also want to point out the aesthetics of these bottles. They definitely look a lot better sitting out in the open in a laundry room or next to a washing machine if the overall look is something you're after. Yeah, I think I'm done buying detergent from big box stores. It's been fun, but it's on to using better items that will enhance the way I take care of myself and the space in my home. I'm really looking forward to trying more cleaning items from the laundress and other luxury brands. Let me know in the comments if you have any recommendations that I can bring to the channel. I'll admit, laundry has always been towards the bottom of my list of things I like to do, but if it means I get to wash my clothes with the Lalabo scent, then I guess I can move it up the list to just before actually folding clothes.